look at this. The Sasquatch on ice. In the ice box. Hold on. Wait for it. It's coming. That's according to one California man. Tom Biscardi, known as the Bigfoot Hunter, claiming, look at this. Here it is. That he has found the body that will confirm with scientific proof that Bigfoot does exist. And Tom joins me now. Hi, Tom. Good morning. All right, so this is an unbelievable picture here. In more ways than one, some would argue, you know you're going to get some gut for this. What is this thing? Where'd you find it? Okay, just got back from Georgia, uh, where two guys actually stumbled upon this out in the woods. Uh, one's an ex-officer who's on administrative leave for, actually he's a hero. He took one for the team. He got shot for suing the perpetrator. And another one is an ex-correctionals officer. And they were on a show, a radio show, Megan, uh, two weeks ago. And uh, the commentator from the show said to him, hey, can we come out and confirm this body? And at that point in time, they stated, the only person that will allow to come out here is the real Bigfoot hunter, Tom Biscardi. So you go out to Georgia, and you see this thing in the woods. Now it's in this freezer, but you see this thing in the woods. Give us an idea of the dimensions. Okay. The, well, the one that you're showing there right now is the one that's actually frozen in a, uh, in a freezer. It's a block of ice. I, the freezer had broken, and Saturday had thawed out, and they showed me the creature. I went back the next day after they showed me in the woods where they actually found this thing, where I actually trotted it to see if it was real. And my God, it's, it's there. It's seven foot seven. Uh, the dimensions on the feet were uh, in excess of 15 inches in length. This is my hand from palm to for the middle finger is in excess of 11 inches, six inches across in width. Uh, you can actually see the teeth Megan, there's no fangs there, so it's not a meat eater. Wait, no, go back to uh, go back to Tom's picture because I want to ask him about it of the of the alleged Bigfoot Tom. Now I got to tell you, you know, you look at this. To me, the top of that looks like a, an eight suit head sitting there. I mean, you you're telling me you've actually laid hands on this thing and and it's real. Yeah, as a matter of fact, that blackness that you see there is water, and that was the problem that they had. They kept putting water in there thinking that it'll freeze up instead of and they didn't know that it was a frostless freezer believe it or not and that's what's what made the uh the freezer go uh, go awry so where's the thing now well it's been moved right now we are uh i'm assembling they've asked me to assemble uh a scientific team already sent the sample for analysis it's the first stage has come back that it has taken and they're waiting for the second sequencing, uh, which we should have probably by Friday or Saturday. But Tom, if this is real, if this is this actually exists, why why won't it? Why not let us lay hands on it? Let us actually see this thing or what's left of it, so we can judge for ourselves. As a matter of fact, I'm here to let you know, Megan. Okay, you have an open invitation from me, from the boys. Okay, that next week when I get the scientists out there. I'm inviting you publicly right now that we want you there. Really? Tom? Yes. You're on. That sounds fantastic. Okay. Atlanta, Georgia. No, no, no. I, I don't know where they uh, moved it. Oh, location but, uh, to be determined. I'll tell you where it's at. All right. You heard it here for, first, folks. Exclusive. America's Newsroom. Tom and I. Tom, you know you've got your doubters out there, but we love having you on. And uh, very interesting photos. Thank you, dear. All the best. Bye-bye. All right. You're on the hunt for you know? Sasquatch. Listen, who, who are we to say it's not the truth? I thought I saw a Rolex watch on the arm of that. Uh, never mind. <laughs> America's Newsroom at FoxNews.com. What are you?